Welcome everyone to another video. This is Pratham from Trips to Developers and in this video we're going to learn about how to add a new contact form fields uh, to your contact form page on the Shopify uh, store. Right, so um, to collect custom information from your customers, you can add more fields to your team's uh, default contact form if you like to. For example, if you want to have uh, radio buttons or check boxes or additional text field to your contact form, you can definitely add that with simple line of codes. Uh, so let's head to our uh, one of our um, contact page uh, of our demo store. Let me refresh that. And uh, if you see, we have three different fields over here. We want to add a new text field uh, to collect our customers' birthdays, for example. So um, this is how you basically do it. Uh, let's head to our Shopify admin panel. And then on the left bar under the sales channel, you will click on the online store. And uh, on the main theme template, uh, you will click the action buttons and uh, edit code. Uh, this will open your code editor. Now you can type in a contact in the search field. And uh, in my case, I have my paid.contact.liquid in uh, the templates. Uh, and uh, you will find you will look for the form uh, starting code like this this will be your form contact um, starting code in every most of the theme basically and it ends with n form over here so uh, this is basically our whole form and uh, these are all the uh, text field uh, which is showing up on the contact form on our contact page basically so um, I want to add um, a new birthday um, label under the um, email. I have a phone uh, label here, but I have commented it out because I don't want that. But I still have the code inside uh, my code editor, uh, but I have commented that out like so. And um, I'll press enter and I type in label because I want to create a new label for, uh, for collecting birthdays. So I will have label for uh, contact form birthday like so and have it called birthday and close down the label and then enter and we have now uh, input field to type in so input type would be text because we want to collect text in the birthday field and then we will give an ID of a contact form birthday which we have up there in label and we also have name it contact birthday and yeah. sorry something like this birthday and then close down the tag and have the placeholder to be called as birthday All right then we close the tab, uh, the tag of the input, and then we save this file. So basically, a two line of code will create a new text field uh, on our contact form. So let's head over to our contact form and uh, let's refresh this. And now you will see uh, we have a new field uh, before the message body, uh, which is called birthday. And I can type in my uh, birthday over here and uh, merchants basically can collect those for their upcoming birthdays or any information you want to add you can add it like that instead of birthday you can use anything you want so yeah um, that's all for today in our next video we'll be covering the radio buttons checkboxes and drop downs. so how to create those inside of our contact form um, this will be our, uh, our second and third part which will cover uh, th those points so uh, thank you very much for anyway for um, your time if you need any help regarding your shop for e-commerce store you can always visit us at trips developers.com or leave us a mail at hello at trips developers.com and we'll be more than happy to assist you with that and in our next video we will cover as I said uh, radio buttons and check boxes and drop down these three points we'll be covering in the next video and thanks again for your time and support please like uh, share and subscribe to this channel to keep me going and make new useful videos for you Signing off. Thank you very much.